back to my channel. Today we have a very fun video, per usual. <laughs> I'm really excited about today's video because I decided to review Amazon's top selling activewear. Literally their best sellers. I filtered Amazon to give me clothing of women, of activewear, and it gave me this top 15 list. I skipped over the socks and things like that because no one wants me to review socks, but I did add everything else to my cart and I was very shocked to see what Amazon's best sellers were. Most of them I will say are leggings, but other ones I was just like, hmm, why is this number one? But I mean, you'll see and you can judge for yourself. Before we get started though, make sure to give this video a thumbs up as it does support my channel and don't forget to subscribe so you never miss a video with me again. All right, without further ado, let's just jump right into this video. First up, literally the best seller on Amazon under activewear are these sweats. They're from Hanes. I'm gonna bring you guys down so you guys can see what I'm, what I'm talking about. <laughs> Why? Anybody, Kona, <laughs> don't worry about it. Why? Anybody, can, can anybody answer me? Why? <laughs> they are so short. I mean, they're lined with fleece. They, they don't fit properly. They're not like, I got a large because typically that's what I am because of my butt, but the waist is ridiculously big. If I bring them down, like, ew! Ew, 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 ew. I hate it, I hate everything about these, I can't. I can't, I can't, I can't, I cannot, I cannot, I cannot, I cannot. <laughs> I literally do not understand why these sweatpants are number one. They're not comfortable at all. Like, they just feel like I have really bad fabric around my legs. <laughs> I, I'm gonna skip these, these are not, nope, not okay, not. I mean, they're like six bucks or seven bucks, something like that, but not, no. Moving on. Okay, next we have these white leggings, high rise, I think they're from Odo is the name of the store. I think you have to be very careful with white. I don't like how my body looks in white. I don't like it at all. These I got in a large, they fit fine. They give me a little bit of camel toe. High rise, yes, it says tummy control. High rise, it feels like any other leggings to be honest. I don't feel like any more tummy control than others, but I think that's what they say for high waisted. Um, you can see the cellulite. I'm pretty sure these are see-through. <laughs> Let's check. Yeah, you know sometimes when you're like, oh, I don't know if it's see-through or not. No, these are definitely see-through because you can see the tag right there. Yeah, these are a, these are a no-go for me. These are actually top three on Amazon. So when I ordered them, they were top two. This was the second one. The other sweatpants were number one, but socks replaced number one. So I brought down the sweatpants to number two, and this was number three. Mm. No go for me. <laughs> All right, friends, we have so much to talk about. Whoever is buying these, we need to talk. It almost feels like the people that are buying this don't know how good their clothes are supposed to feel on their bodies because this does not feel good. This is a sports bra, came in a pack of three. This white one, I can't even breathe <laughs> getting this stuff on. This gray one and then this black one. The sports bras are just regular sports bras. I feel like they're like the ones that you would buy like at Walmart or something. They do have the padding in there. Oh, my nail stuck. The padding in there. Are they removable? Yes, they are removable. But they're probably see-through if you take those out, but you can see it through the fabric. Now these leggings I'm kind of upset about. This was number four. These are Color Folka. I don't know how to pronounce that, the, the name of the company, but I did a review on some leggings from Amazon and they were my favorite ones from that last review. This one, not so much. It was really difficult to get on. These are the same size that I ordered from last time. These are medium and these are the ones with their pockets. This fabric feels a little waxy to me and I don't know if that's correct, like how I'm describing it, but it feels like hard and rough to put on, like they get stuck on my legs. They are kind of soft. They're soft, but kind of waxy soft, if that makes sense. Camel toe, like crazy. They do have the pocket, which is nice. And the contour that everyone has now. I don't love them just because the sizing is not consistent and the way the fabric feels. Now, I do love the other ones that they came out with that I have, but not, for some reason, I don't love these and the fabric just feels a little bit different. So this is also a no-go for me. <laughs> Moving on. All right, next up, we have these 90 degree reflex. I was really pumped to try these because everyone raves about these. I don't get it. <laughs> Maybe I didn't get the right ones. These are the ones that are fleece lined, so like 
They keep you really warm. I cannot wait to get these off because I'm sweating. But they are high-waisted. They don't have the contour and the booty. I just, like, can't wear this anymore. I can't believe that I actually wore leggings just with the seam straight across the back. Like, I need that contour, you know what I mean? But anyway, these are fleece-lined. Keep you nice and warm. They fit okay. Again, this also has a little bit of that waxy feel that I was talking about earlier. I don't know if it's the fleece that does that or what, but I, it's not my favorite. And then the sports bra is the same as the white one, just in black. I will say though, for the pack of three, this one feels much tighter. They're all the same size. I got a large. I was just reading the measurement, the size charts on their website. It said to get a large, so I got a large. The black one feels a little bit tighter than the white one, which is kind of weird. But yeah, this is an NWB reflex. Let's see if it's see-through. I don't think it should be, but here we go. Oh, these are good. <laughs> these are good. But I'm gonna take them off because I'm sweating. <laughs> Okay, next up we have these joggers. These joggers were right after the 90 degree reflex fleece leggings and these joggers go for $30. Um, mm, they're a little big on the waist. I can try to do that to it. It scrunches up the waistband, but for the sake of this video, we'll just do it. Still a little bit big. I got the light pink because I thought it was just so cute. The fabric is it's stretchy. It does feel a little bit cheap, especially this ribbon. I'll come in closer so you guys can see, but it just feels a little bit cheap and I don't think that they're worth $30. Like it almost feels like they came out of Fashion Nova and I hope that doesn't offend anyone, but this is literally how it feels. It just feels a little bit on the cheaper side. The joggers are really thin. I'm pretty sure that these are see-through. I'm gonna do a squat test, not that you'd really be squatting in joggers, but still they feel like they would be see-through. So here we go. Heck yeah, you can see that. Okay, moving on. <laughs> <sighs> Holy smokes, guys. I am sweating putting on these leggings. You probably can't even see them because they're nude color. Okay. Oh, this waistband goes real high. <sighs> okay. These leggings are from a brand called Homa. And these... <sighs> I can't breathe. <laughs> these are labeled as thick waist, waist slimming, thinning leggings. Say that five times fast. <laughs> I got the color that's most popular and this one, this nude color. I don't hate them because they do feel nice everywhere. Like they fit me pretty good. The waistband is what's really, really long. I would like them to be maybe like that. I don't hate that. What do you think? Now let's do the squat test. I am not going to show you because this is too see-through. Like, this is not okay. This is a child-friendly YouTube channel, so we're not going to we're not gonna do that. These leggings cost, I think, 20 bucks. Now, for 20 bucks, you should know what you're getting. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. They don't even have, like, the booty contour. <laughs> I, no, I don't like, no. Mm-mm. Moving on. <laughs> I actually don't know what's going on here. These, um, <laughs> Uh, mm, these are the scrunch butt. It wouldn't be a top 10 without a scrunch butt, you know what I mean? Um, they're high-waisted, extremely high-waisted. I don't think they're supposed to be this high-waisted. And then the back is just... Mm, 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 this is weird. <laughs> it's got the seams that go here and then it's got the scrunch butt in the back. Got the scrunch butt in the back. And it's a light pink color. It makes you feel <laughs> like you're naked. Also, the fabric is extremely thin. I haven't done the squat test yet, but I'm pretty positive that these are see-through. Here we go. Oh, wait. I don't know. I don't know. Like, I can see the tag. So that means, yeah, right? <laughs> Why are people buying these? Is that really mean? I'm sorry, but like, but like what? Like this is, this is a lot. Like, like what? This is a lot. These are I think $9 or $10, but again, you get what you pay for, right? <laughs> oh, I just read, it says tummy control. Is that why they are so high? Like I, and also the elastic, the waistband is this thick, but the elastic around it is only that thick so i don't i don't know are you supposed to go like this no that doesn't make sense i don't know let's try these last ones same company here we go okay so these fit a tiny bit better they're not as like high up 
but they're no go for me. Also super see-through. This fabric is so incredibly thin that me just like taking a step, you can see my entire butt hole. <laughs> and yeah, no, like I get, I get the whole scrunch butt thing. Believe me, I do. I always want my butt to look good, but like this is pushing it. <laughs> I don't understand. Like these do not look good on me at all. I know that there are some people that can pull these off, but your girl cannot. <laughs> I, yeah, no. I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you like them? Like, you can see the tag. Like, what? I, I don't know. You guys, honestly, we need to do an intervention with Amazon's top 10 because this is, this is, people could not be wearing these things. <laughs> is that mean? I just, okay, maybe I can't be wearing these things. Let's just call it what it is. They don't look good on me. For those of you that can pull this off, more power to you. But your girl, like I said earlier, cannot. I honestly would not buy any of these. If I ran outside, maybe the 90 degree reflex ones and the colorful koala, maybe that's what it's called. And I'd probably size up in that one. Because I do have another pair of theirs that I do enjoy, <laughs> just not that one. But that's the video, guys. Let me know what you liked, what you disliked, what you think should be removed, what you think should be added on this list. I thought this was really interesting because it's interesting to see what people buy you know, as a whole. And let's be honest, Amazon does pick these collectively. It's not like just like the Fitzbo scene or just like the fitness scene. Everyone is buying these leggings. So I feel like people that are not into fitness, this is what they're going to. This is what they're gravitating towards. I want to hear what you guys think. Did you guys like any of these things? Did you hate them? I personally don't like any of them. I, if anything, would keep two of them, the colorful koala ones and the 90 degree reflex one. That's pretty much it. That's just my opinion. Let me know what you guys would choose, if anything, what you liked, what you did it. And let me know if you want me to do more of these videos. This is actually really fun to see what people are buying. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Mwah.